We're also looking at space. Uh, one of the things that we're looking at as Rwanda is how do we leverage uh, data in general, but very specifically geospatial data, uh, to support some of the programs and policies that we are driving in agriculture, in education, in uh, mining, uh, infrastructure development. And we see great examples globally on how uh, geospatial data is being uh, leveraged and utilized to really inform some of the policy decisions we are making and some of the programs we do implement. And so we know UAE is quite advanced in this area and we would like to learn. Uh, but just to summarize on this, what we're really looking at is in every field that we're looking to cooperate, the anchor of those kinds of cooperations is around knowledge and skills transfer and building the right capabilities that will allow us to benefit from uh, the experience that uh, UAE has. And finally, um, UAE has a very good government um, uh, you know, experience exchange program uh, that is also heavily focused on technology and innovation, looking at how UAE has deployed uh, various technologies and innovations to really improve efficiencies and drive productivity. And so that's another framework that we're looking uh, to engage on uh, with UAE. It's, it's actually a mix of both. And, and, and the starting point, like I said, is building capacity. You can have access to, um, you know, different uh, geospatial data sets, but do you have the capacity and the ability to mine and analyze and, uh, you know, translate that into a way that creates value for us? And so that's our starting point, being able to have those analytical skills and tools uh, that will allow us to really, uh, you know, use that data um, into, uh, you know, in, into valuable insights uh, for our policies and, and, and programs that we, we do implement. Now, we also have ambitions, obviously, of, uh, you know, partnering with countries like UAE uh, to build and be able to launch our own satellite. Um, and that may be a mid to long term uh, ambition that would start working on even as we already think about the low hanging fruit, which is really around building, um, you know, uh, analytical skills around how we can make the best use of this uh, geospatial data.